War is coming and everybody in the realm is restless. Not only are the lords and the knights restless because they want to just see some blood. I am restless. Are you restless? I'm restless. I don't want to call the pacing slow because I've just had only two episodes. This is the third episode that we just watched. I'm really just restless for one. Episodes with war in them are actually so always so badass. Yeah. That's what I'm really just craving for. I mean, when Rena you know, turns in that final episode of um, How to Dragon Season 1, I was thinking that every episode will be back to back war. Thus far, I've just been seeing a build up to the war. Everybody's trying to avoid war because they know how drastic it's going to be. I'm ready to bring it on. Everybody's ready. Even the dragons are restless. And yeah. the citizens of the realm, they are restless. Everybody's like, okay, when is this going to happen? Who is going to strike first? And two feuding houses in the Riverlands, the Blackwoods and the Brackens, took it upon themselves. To start this war yeah. over a little land dispute they are usually uh, disputing anyway. yeah they always dispute anyway but the blackwoods mm -hmm. are team black and the brackens are team gray don't you think that scene they should have should showed us the worst thing because it ended and they just showed the battlefield with dead bodies and blood i'm like oh, i want to see it i think it was okay that they just showed us the Everybody is already down. I prefer that. I liked it. I like the I like the sequence. It's not bad, but, but you see this. Um, I really want water. The war I want to see between dragons. Like I said, they are trying to avoid this war by all means necessary. So Rene said to Rene that okay, Alison seems sensible. Alison looks like someone who's although she's in Team Green, she also yeah. doesn't want this war. Maybe she talk to her. Maybe there will be a way to get through with this. I wonder why the Queen and her auntie are trying to just. Call it back because they know bit. what war will bring. Yeah, and the fact that dragons are involved is going to yeah. be bloody and hot. Star Christian Cole, now Lord Hand of the King, came up with this plan that he was going to go to Harren Hall with a really little army and they will take over Harren Hall because Harren Hall is one of the biggest castles in the realm. On their way, he can add to his troops. I think it's a really bold plan because you really cannot tell what will happen to you along the way. Aegon wanted to follow Christian Cole by all means necessary when he was told recently don't go and he decided not to go. But I feel bad for him that everybody's trying to shield him from everything. They're just pushing him to show his strength. On the other hand, Damon went to Harren Hall. He was expecting some sort of fierce battle because he wanted to take over the castle. But the Lord Strong there, he just conceded welcomed him to eat the only like, interesting thing that happened in that scene was when Damon started to have dreams first of all he saw Rhaenyra he, trying to sew back the severed head of the little Jaehaerys then after that on that sequence went to what he was assigned to that famous dream in the vision this lady told him that you will die in this place that thing I also have to see me in the alcohol again in this scene because after they did the uh, Times jump and she grew up and we had Emma Darcy. This is the one I really want to see more of Miliako playing Princess Rhaenyra. These visions with Daemon, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it. It's just. Well, I don't know why everybody's just really shifting at the edge of this. We all know that they're all going to die. They just have to chop it up and know that these people are going to die. I so, yeah. I'm, I've made peace with it. What is more, most interesting about me for that scene is that he saw. Rhaenyra, a younger version. He didn't see a vision the of the older, older Rhaenyra is the younger one. That was the Rhaenyra that looked up to him, that really admired him, that, oh my yes. god, my uncle is so cool. And so I now, think that's why he saw her. Yeah. And instead of this new one that is mad at him and saying, oh, you disappointed me. Yes. While back at Dragonstone, Rhaenyra decides to send Reyna and her younger children and some dragon eggs to protect the Targaryen line just for safekeeping. When things go south, there should be like a backup plan. And it was a touching thing for her because she would love to be part of this type instead of nursing babies and taking care of them. She wanted more. But I think this responsibility that was given to her is a really huge one because now you are the future. You are taking yeah. care of the future. You are in charge of it. Yes, there is this interesting character that just emerged. He is claiming to be the brother of King Viserys and the money half brother. Yeah. So I am curious to see what that character is going to do because there he is in King's Landing. So is he going to be in Team Black? Is he going to? I don't know. And while he finished talking, the king and his silly friends came to that place too. So yeah, I'm interested. I don't know. Maybe people will try to use him because you know when people hear, okay, there's another person that could have yeah. taken this position. They are just more rivals to take down at the end of the day. So I'm hoping it's going to be something really exciting. As for Christian Cole on his way to Harren Hall with Alison's brother. Alison's brother actually came and joined him. So Bela was patrolling with her dragon 
one dancer and she spotted them. I was so excited with this thing here. Eh? She started chasing them with the dragon and they ran into the forest. Lucky for them. But she did not enjoy Lucky. It. I don't think they were lucky. I think they were smart. So that person called is very observant in that yeah, scene. He was fast. He was very observant. He was, he was fast. And Renera already doesn't want too much blood test. She's yeah. already advised that they should not engage. So Vela did not engage. But ah, I was so happy that I saw him sweat. That scene, I think I'm the only person I did not expect the dragon to uh, open fire. I was almost saying, oh, I thought Renera told you not to engage. I just supposed to see you. They said, just look oh, over God. this guy. Stay far. They told her, stay far. So when she was coming down and she allowed them to see her, and when she was reporting to Renera, she was like, yeah. yeah. I think it will affect what happens next because it can influence Kotu to now move faster. We have to move faster and get because now he knows that Renera know where all have an idea of yeah. where he's going. So it it will definitely affect the way things will play out further. So I think she should have yes, it's true. She should have not engaged with them in any way at all, even if she was. I was worried that they were not supposed to see you. This is um this is a tactic. It's also just observe, yeah. not show off your prowess. Anyway, for Renera's part, Renera decided to concede. Renice is wise and she has something here. Let me talk to, to Alison. So she went to Kingsland in a disguise. She went to meet Alison in the scepter. She joined her while she was praying. Alison is very religious. Try to talk to her like mother to mother. Let us end this. And she would say, Oh, I was not aware. You know, I would never do something like that to your grandchild. And what about my own son? But Alison told Renera that he said Aegon. He called his name Aegon. Cool, your, yes, your father changed his mind. So confidently. See, Renera was already even down that, oh, oh my yeah. god, my, my love father did not want me to be king. He changed his mind. Alison, so clueless, God bless her heart. She was like, oh, he said the prince that was promised. Then he said, Egon. And Renera was like, you don't even know that story. And you are drawing for blood. You don't know that story that is about Egon. Egon the conqueror. And Alison was like, I have messed up. So, so that's where it ended. I don't think that they would have not tried to usurp the crown from Renera, regardless, regardless yeah. of who the egg on or whatever. They'll say, oh no, hey, people don't want to see a woman on the throne. Yeah. They would have still fought Renera for Even if she sat on the throne, people yeah, would still plot. Still... There are even stories that people, when they know that there are other heirs or second sons, people start using them yeah. to take power. Now or you're having king. If you really answers. want to be king, you can take down your younger yeah. siblings if you feel like, or just send them away. So it's going to happen either way. I think them dragging on Renera saying, oh, I don't want war, I don't want trouble. It's already too much. We know she doesn't want it. Just three episodes in, anyway. I, I, don't, I mean, I want action, but. When I think of the action, I said, okay, maybe because we we'll have to wait for another episode. So that's why the anticipation is really big. I think I'm trying to make the thing very more look more bad. or Because now, in, uh, of course, I still cannot go, go, out, go out and say, oh, I made a mistake. It's not possible. Yeah. It's not possible. So that means everybody that died was just for nothing. So, yeah. So, trailer is out for the episode oh. four. I think they are going to draw blood in this episode. The team have said that it will be the best episode yet. So, I am at the edge of my seat. I am, I am ready. Honestly, when it drops, I will be there. Will you be there? Of course. For yeah. Again. So you should definitely like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, do take care of yourself.